Holy So I just like got a nice meeting. I finally got somebody today, which I'm stoked about, to actually sit down and talk to me. What's going on guys? So today we are going to be going door to door as you guys have requested. I've got uh, <clears throat> a buddy of mine coming with me. He'll be recording everything and I'm going to hopefully set it up so um, I'll have the mic recording every time I go into a business. We might not bring the cameras in, might leave the cameras outside. We'll see how things go. Uh, yeah, so let's get started. Oh, we're in the car and I am already late to go pick up uh, Rune. Rune's the guy's name. And I got a fit on my nose. It's just not even like, a, it's just red. It's just really red. <sighs> what a day. Oh. Go on, man. I was so drunk last night when I agreed to this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, I'm awkwardly sitting back here. I brought my, uh, hold up. Sorry, there. Oh, there you go. I can see you now. Oh, got the flyers created. Business card attached right here. I just broke that off. I'm fucking pissed now. I don't have very many of those. I'm going to go in and uh, we're pitching to the jewelry store right now. I got the mic all hooked up and hopefully, uh, hopefully that'll work out. But we will see. <sighs> Hi, how are you doing? Good, Good thank you very much. Uh, are you the uh, owner? No. Nope. No, is the owner in? Uh, the owner's not here. She's not here. Who is a manager? She's a manager. Um, can I talk to her? She's on the phone right now. That's no big deal. Can I just give you something then? Sure. Just give the owner. Um, I run just a marketing agency, so I do advertising stuff through social media, uh, like Facebook ads and stuff like that. So, because the old way of advertising doesn't really work so much anymore when it comes to like advertising on the radio stuff, when I can specifically target people who are interested in marriage, interested in whatever. Very interesting. Yeah, because nowadays, I guess, it's, this it's, is the only way to really get. Things have, have changed quite a bit, and that's why I've, I've started this, because I've learned, I've started a couple of businesses, I have a few businesses on my own, and I learned that the old way of advertising wasn't really working and then I started researching it more and more and I found out that doing it this way kind of works because you'd be surprised how much the internet actually tracks everything that you Everybody do. Everybody in every age. Exactly. So I'm able to like specifically target if, if, if I knew that you were looking at, constantly looking at um, wedding venues, I'd be able to know that you were probably getting married or if you were constantly looking at wedding rings, I could target you in this area targets you specifically and get you to look at the ad. Unlike radio ads where you're targeting everybody and you're kind of wasting your money because you're not. Oh, I see. You see what I'm saying? Like how I could, so just specifically. it's very specific people. That way you're not wasting money on people who aren't even potential clients. Like if, uh, you know, I could turn on the radio and a three-year-old could listen to a radio ad about a jewelry store, you know. It means nothing. It, yeah, it, there's no there's no point of it, right? It's, um family-run business, mm -hmm. and they've been in the business for some time now. Good. Yeah. That's they got four like locations. Oh, really? Yeah. That's yeah. good. Yeah. Where is the, uh, the owner the from? head office in, uh, is the owner there, and he is in Aurelia. Aurelia? Yeah. All right. Craft, do, do you happen to have, like, uh, a number that the head office could be reached at? Or? Okay. Perfect. So John Murphy is the son. PD is still around. But John Murphy is the one, is the, John John is the is one the running it. This particular Perfect. Well, thank you very much. What was your You're name? Very welcome. My name is. Thank you. Yeah. Nice to meet you. It was you. nice meeting you. Thank you. We had to pick a day that was like negative fucking twenty out to do this. Okay. So I managed to get the owner's number. Owner wasn't there. No big deal. Uh, I got the owner's number and I left the flyer with them. So what I'm going to be able to do now is um, I actually got their email on here too. And I'm noticing right off the bat, one thing you guys want to look at is on the email, the bottom of the card there, this my focus there. The bottom of the card, it has an email. There we go. 
but the email does not have a dot com like it doesn't have their website it's a mail service so that tells me right off the bat they don't have a website and if they don't have a website that's pretty big right off the bat creating a website alone i can charge 600 dollars for for something like this i would charge a little bit more because there's a lot of products that i want to put on the website they have six locations two no six locations four four or six locations i can't quite remember uh, i think it's four locations i don't know where i got the number six from which means that I could manage all of them. So that's a potentially huge client. We're now gonna head over to a coffee shop. I know that we only hit up one store so far, but we're heading over to a coffee shop right now to just grab some Wi-Fi. I've got a Skype meeting with a potential partner, business partner of mine. You know what would be amazing? And I know like you were talking about this too, like is, uh, but they're kind of corporations, so it's harder, is uh, uh, dealerships. Getting getting like these small, more like small town dealerships type of thing. But I would love to have, oh, this guy's being nice. I would love to get like, the the, the dealership in uh, up in Barrie here, they advertise like crazy. You know which one I'm talking about? The uh, Paul, Sav Paul Savern Motors. They advertise like crazy. And that's like, that's somebody who I'd love to sit down and talk with. I will 100% try and talk to that guy. I'm gonna look him up tonight. I'm gonna try and get his contact information because yeah. He doesn't have ads on, on social media that I've seen. I've been interested in vehicles. If I'm looking up on Kijiji vehicles, I want to be able to see his ad. His ad should be coming up and telling me to buy from him. And somebody like that, the good thing about somebody, especially dealerships or anybody in general who are paying for advertising already, they're more, people who are paying for advertising already are more likely to pay for advertising. Working now, well, I guess we're doing it on the computer then. Hey, man. Hey, what's going on, man? So we just got done with, uh, Another, we just had two big uh, Skype calls, 30 minute Skype calls uh, regarding business partners and uh, people who are, one of them was a, a guy who does uh, analytics, who really focuses on um, creating spreadsheets and stuff that would tell you exactly who's clicking on what, who's, well, I guess that's kind of what he did. Eh? He just kind of gave you a better detail if you want to do like a business audit he would give you like instead of just doing a what i have it's just so simple it's just i look at i have a few websites that i utilize that i do like uh i check out like uh, the speed of the website all that stuff but it's very simple he would be able to create a very detailed business audit uh which would then the, the only issue with that is we'd have to work out is is that something that he can do for free because the business audit is for free am i going to pay to do a business audit versus having one that's for free that I can do myself or am I going to pay somebody into it to do it or do we just use it for clients who are already going to pay it was interesting to talk to somebody who does that uh, definitely something that I'd be interested in before that I talked to a guy regarding the creating uh, something that I want to do with expanding my business and uh, he's a business partner that I was talking to We've done all of our sitting around today and now it's just gonna be a grind of just going from door to door to go get some clients. Uh, I've got a bunch of stuff that we need to hand out. We might need to walk, run into Walmart to get some paper clips to paper clip uh, all the business cards to the flyer because I don't think I brought a stapler. Oh, paper clips, paper clips, paper clips. A lot less businesses than you thought around here, eh? Not a lot of like... Oh, the hard part is finding what business to do. It's frustrating sometimes trying to find an area that has just a lot of them but it's just about going out and actually doing it and not being uh, worried not being scared that you're gonna get shut down because getting shut down is just you learn from it it's just something else that you can learn from and every time you do it you you learn more from it how are you going on um, is the owner in today? Uh, no, he doesn't come in. I'm the manager. Here. You're the manager? Yes. Perfect. Uh, do you guys know if you guys do any advertising? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. perfect. Um, so I do social media advertising, like Facebook ads and stuff yeah. like that. And um, I was hoping to sit down with the owner and maybe talk about doing some advertising for him. Um, he if, doesn't usually come in here. He has another job. Okay, um, okay. So I can give you, you can say, do you have contact a, information. That'd be awesome, like. man. Um, yeah, this is my email. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then, uh, then you can email all the information and he can get back to you through Perfect. there. That'd be amazing, huh? Yeah. If you had one recommendation for me to eat out of these options here, what would you say? If you're hungry, I would suggest the muffin. They're all homemade. Make them every morning. Let's try some of this muffin, man. It's delicious. Apple oat. 
Mm. What are you off to next? I'm gonna do the lures. All right. I'll go for it. So I got uh, another business card from the lawyer's office, wherever I put that. I think maybe I put it in my wallet, I guess. Well, I'm gonna sit down when we're done all this today and just make a bunch of phone calls, but I'm not sure what time to make them at. I don't I'd... wanna be a dick and call it dinner time, though. Oh yeah, I'd probably just wait till tomorrow. You think? Oh, tomorrow's Saturday. Wait till Monday. Send it's like holidays are over, like people will be back in the office. Yeah, that's fair. The mall, Dude, the mall's sketchy as fuck. Yeah. Is it a sketchy mall? Very sketchy. Have you been in it? No, my parents just say it's really sketchy. Yeah, okay, but your parents also say very sketchy in general. Yeah. Alright, well, no shame in trying, right? Alright, good luck. Oh, thanks man. Are you sure you don't, uh, sure you don't want to come on this adventure? No, it's all good. <laughs> Such a pussy. Good, how are you two doing? I'm good, thank you. Good. Um, I was hoping to talk to somebody about advertising. Advertising? Advertising. I don't know who you'd want me to talk to about Do that. You but want to call Perfect, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Hey. How's it going? Good, how are you? Yes, my name's Hayden. Hayden? Hayden. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, you want to fix it? Yeah, go ahead. So I run a social media marketing agency. So I market small businesses and um, trying to get into more law firms now online doing their Facebook and running Facebook ads and creating video content for them as well to get a more personal touch between your clients. Okay. Do, you, do you guys currently run any ads like no, that? No, but your timing is good because that's the sort of stuff that I'm looking at. I'm actually just trying to create some landing pages and do all that stuff. It's a huge market, mm -hmm. huge market that a lot of businesses aren't tapping into. Do you guys have a web page? Yeah, we do. We okay. have a website. Uh, do you advertise on there? To be honest with you, no. We're not using AdWords, we're not... I know. Yeah. I know. <laughs> so the, the thing is that about that is, even if we do advertise on Google, which I do do, I'll make sure you're at the top of the search if somebody looks up like uh, lawyers. I would want that to be a key thing that you guys are coming up. Yeah. But the problem with that is Google, you're just blue letters on top of blue letters. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. When you look it up, nothing special about it. Right. It's about setting you guys apart. You guys have a nice design. You guys look unique. You look uh, up to date. Presenting that to somebody mm -hmm. and then also being able to specifically target them is what I do. So the key thing about Facebook is that if somebody's constantly looking up lawyers, I'm able to target them specifically yeah. and make sure that they're the ones seeing your ad. On the radio advertising, everyone's hearing it. Right. You know, Because 10 year old Timmy on the radio hears your ad, that you're paying however much for, it doesn't make any That's sense. That's great that Timmy's hearing it, but are the right people here? Exactly. Right? I would sit down with you and we talk about what you want done, what your goal is. I recommend creating a video that would explain who you are that we could post. Yeah. Because my understanding would be it's kind of a personal thing when you have a lawyer. Once you get a lawyer, you kind of get them for life. Do you not? A lot of your mm -hmm. clients are kind of lifelong yep. clients. Yeah. If you do them right, they yeah. come back. Exactly. Yeah. So it's really about having that personal touch with them, right? Yeah. So creating a video that someone would be able to see and say, you know what, I really like this guy, I like what he's about. We'd explain how you got into it. It's a very personal touch that you add to it. That's one thing I offer along with, do you guys do email marketing at all? Holy shit. So I just got a nice meeting. I finally got somebody today, which I'm fucking stoked about, to actually sit down and talk to me. So that was a law firm I just spoke to and I finally got them to actually sit down, talk to me, um, which was amazing. What they're concerned, they just moved into a new location, so they've got a much higher overhead cost-wise. So they want to do something. He was telling me that he's like, dude, I, he's like, your timing's immaculate. I've been looking for somebody to do this. I, I don't know what I'm doing, all this stuff. You heard the conversation. Crazy that, that that just happened. I know that I'm very excited by this, and the reason is this is a lawyer's and lawyers, as you guys hear in the conversation, like something that you're gonna need in a business. So if you can get a lawyer client, you can negotiate price because you need something done. You can work something out. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to even give them my uh, my contract because my contract I made up on online. So I don't know how good my, my contract really is compared to what a lawyer could actually do. I didn't put any money into it. I just did a free, free thing online. I'm just excited. That was awesome. So. So far today, we've only gotten business cards, but we've gotten the names of 
some big law firms. We got a couple law firms that we're gonna deal with. We've got some jewelry stores with the owners and we've got a cafe with the owner's email and all that. So today was actually successful as much as it didn't seem like it. And we're gonna go continue to keep grinding and continue to go get some more clients because you know, why not man? Let's keep going. <laughs>